All right, guys, welcome back. This is the first video of a brand new project. This is the Beachmaster. It's a pulse induction metal detector, and this project was kindly designed and offered by Graham Oliver, one of the members of the Geotech Forum. So without further ado, let's get right into it. We're going to be looking at the Transmit Pulse Generator. Okay, this is a, a very, very compact printed circuit board. You can see it is predominantly surface mount devices. And it's not only one side, it's double sided. So the, the, the rear of the board is also packed with devices. Um, so this is one side and let's take a look at the other side. Alright, here's the second side of the board and now let's uh, proceed with the instructions and we'll take a look at the oscilloscope alright so we're going to be looking at the transmit pulse generator and uh, here we are with the oscilloscope probes hooked up appropriately so <clears throat> the scope probe is attached to test point one and the ground lead is attached to test point six. And show you a little bit closer view of approximately where we are there. All right. Now we'll apply power and switch back to a look at the oscilloscope. All right, guys. As promised, uh, here's the shot of the oscilloscope showing the transmit pulse generator. So you can see the pulse as it is, and if you manipulate uh, pot number one, right, you can see in the lower right hand corner of the scope, the frequency increasing. We're at uh, 1.64 kilohertz, and if I turn it the opposite direction, we get down to 630 okay and we're going to go back to the recommended frequency of 1000 so fairly close to 1000 right there turn this so you can see the pulse width so we are at uh, 50 microseconds we can increase that as you can see up to about 75 and on the lower end down to 25 so back to 50 that's approximately it so there we go guys and we are going to go on to building the power supply in the next video thanks